Hey guys, we got some fresh powder last night and we're gonna take out the Jeep versus the snowmobile and let you guys decide on what is the ultimate snow machine. Stay tuned. So the first thing we're going to try is towing a sn uh, snowboarder behind the Jeep and the snowmobile. We're going to uh, try to do some jumps and just ride. But for the tow rope, we're going to use a long recovery strap. So. Far, far enough. Do it kind of on the side of the loop. Don't hold the back or else it might pinch your hand. Just do this. Okay. You going first, Ma? <laughs> yes. It should be fun. It's kind of a, uh, hopefully it's not too sticky. It is wet snow, that's for sure. Time to get out there and earn the hot chocolate. And she's off. First time back on the board. not deep enough to do too hard of car carves. It's uh, got caught in some grass. But that's fun. Feels good to be back on the board.
hot chocolate time. So I'm making some hot chocolate for the boys. They're still playing in the powder. What a fun day this was, going between the Jeep and the snowmobile. My word, I would have to say the snowmobile is pretty fun. It can turn really fast, um, but there's nothing like the Jeep. I mean, you can't make hot chocolate with the snowmobile. Good so point, I would good pick point. <laughs> the Jeep, and it was actually funner being pulled behind the Jeep for me, at least. But uh, yeah, that's my decision on Jeep versus snowmobile. So Pete, after towing behind both vehicles and driving, what is your ultimate snow machine? Uh, well, definitely for driving, I think the Jeep is my favorite. Um, it was a lot of fun to drive and kind of slide around in the snow. Uh, towing behind, I did like the snowmobile more because, uh, especially for this jump here, it's a more nimble machine. It can get into tighter places and a lot easier over bumps to go fast. So, uh, but being towed, one didn't really make much of a difference. Just uh, for speed in tight places, the snowmobile has an edge over the Jeep. All right, Dan? Uh, for the ultimate snow machine, it'd probably definitely be the uh, snowmobile for me, just because this is what it's made for, and it just, like, I can handle a lot better. Um, but for towing, again, this one, like Peter said, would probably be better as well, because you can get a bit more speed without worrying about drifting out. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> no, I can't. <laughs> Leave in the comments which one you think is the ultimate snow machine. If it's the Jeep or the snowmobile, we'd love to hear from you. Oh, that's beauty. You know, um, when the snow hits, some people, or you get in snowy conditions, some people say, well, I'm, I get cabin fever, I'm stuck inside, there's nothing to do. But man, if you, uh, if you think about it, snowy areas can be a real playground. Yeah. If you have a machine like this, or you can get your hands on one, we used to rent them back when we couldn't afford them. Um, but you think between snowboarding, snowshoeing, cross-country skiing, sledding. sledding, I mean, how is that? Oh, this is the funnest thing ever. Uh, just going along here, there's tons of pow and down farther in the field. And then just letting this thing go to its limits and just go full speed is really fun. And then you start drifting in some of the icier spots and you have to lean to the one side. It's really, it's a lot of fun. Start wow. up, take it for a rip. Thank <laughs> you. 